What's up everyone? So today I'm going to show you how you can make your own ant colony in a test tube. Here you can see the queen ants moving around. There's already some eggs, which is very quickly actually. Because I've done this in the past and it would take like on average a month or something. Let's first prepare the test tube. All you need is some water. I'm just going to use some regular spring water. Pour it in. Not too much, like half the test tube. Carefully. Yeah, that's more than enough. Now let's take some cotton and fluff it up like this. This will do just fine. To avoid air bubbles, just push it down quickly into the water. Like this. Well, I didn't avoid air bubbles. <laughs> but there's a solution for that. If I have something thin and pointy, which I do have. I have my dissection kit here. So let's take one of these. And remove the air bubble. Voila! No air bubble. Going to pour out the excess water. So the ants are going to live in this part and stay hydrated because of this. And this end I'm also going to close with some cotton. Let's get to open the bottle with our ants and hopefully none of them will escape. They've been in the bottle for like five days I think. Here I made some air holes. Oh there is an ant here. Oh there are multiple ants here. Also some eggs. This species is Orolasius flavus, Orolasius niger, one of the two. Okay, here are some eggs, I'm just going to try to scoop them up. And with the cotton I will push them inside and then they can take it their own. Final one. Look, she's already busy with the eggs. Look at this. This is awesome. No, no, go inside. Yes. Let's put some cotton for now. Normally these species don't form multiple queen colonies. But I've done it in the past successfully with like 7 queens. It was very successful. I sold the colonies by now. But now I'm going to make a colony of at least 10. Or at least I'm going to try to make it. I think because they've been in the same bottle, they all have the same scent. Because ants recognize each other like different colonies on their scent, so... You can see they're not dangerous or something. No, 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 don't go out. Here you go. Here is one trying to get away. I already have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight queens in the test tube. To get the X out I also have to be a little closer, so I'm going to cut again. Let's get our two queens out. Okay, let's just do this. Okay, that's one with a bunch of X. Just 
scoop them in. All right. Okay, all of them are officially inside. Let's get a nice shot for you guys. Would you look at that? Ten queens from Lazius Flavis or Niger as one super colony or soon to be super colony. Ten queens inside this test tube and colony setup. If you want to see some updates, don't forget to subscribe, it really helps. The support has been great on the last few videos. Thanks for everything. Thanks for watching and I see you guys next week.